Resolution of ongoing disputes at a number of workplaces was the focal point of discussion at the Grenada Technical and Allied Workers Union 4th General Council meeting held under the theme Reigniting the Power of the Labour Movement as Grenada Celebrates 50 and Beyond. Speaking to our news team ahead of the meeting, Andre Lewis, President General of TAU, explained the significance of the General Council. The General Council is the second highest decision making body of the Union. We have a China National Congress conference that takes place once every three years that is made up of all of our members. The General Council is a delegate delegate system where all of the workplaces are represent, that represented by the shop through and one representative for every 25 member part thereof. And as I said, it is the second highest decision making body. That is where we review the decisions or the policies taken by the Trinidad National Con Conference. We review performance of the budget or finances, assess and address and analyze and take decisions relative to the prevailing industrial relations climate and what we assess and analyze um, as a way forward. Lewis said today's meeting was well attended. I'm represented here today, as you can see, we have airport workers, we have port authority workers, we have Greenlake workers, we have cable and wireless workers, we have breweries workers, because we represent workers to all sections of the economy. We have the caregivers here, we have the media here, media workers at the established media houses are with town. Apart from the issues discussed regarding ongoing industrial disputes with companies whose workers the union represents, on the agenda was also the alarming state of affairs in Haiti. So these are matters that we are discussing. Um, the issue of our solidarity with Haiti, I'm calling for a resolution of the matter in Haiti, for lives to be respected in Haiti, for the United States and the other superpowers uh, that are using the situation in Haiti to create and continue for the chaos in Haiti. We are asking them to desist and to stop that and to allow the people of Haiti and the workers of Haiti to be able to make their own decision. So these are some of the issues that we are discussing. But the main thing, it is part of the democracy of the Union. That is what keeps Kawu so strong. So all of the workplaces come here today and the main part, 70% or more, time shall be spent and will be spent to address the workplace issues. The meeting was held at the Seamen and Waterfront Workers Union headquarters, also known as Otway House. Reporting for GBN News, Beverly Tellisford.